question 19. X and Y are elements in period 3. Y has a greater atomic number than X. Okay, so this statement is telling us the X is uh, on left in period 3 compared to Y. Because across the period, the atomic number increases. So it's uh, showing that the Y it must be on the right hand side. So second statement. The stable ion formed by Y has a greater radius than the stable ion formed by X. Okay, before we continue, uh, let's tell you uh, the possible ions that can be formed by these uh, period 3 elements. The first four elements, sodium, magnesium, aluminum, silicon, they will release electron and form cations. After they release electrons, it will form uh, the isoelectronic configuration, which is uh, 1s2, 2s2, 2p6 for all. All these ions, they're having the same electronic configuration. We call isoelectronic configuration. For the last three elements, phosphorus, sulfur, and chlorine, they will gain electrons. Phosphorus will gain three electrons to form the phosphide. Sulfur will gain two electrons to form sulfide. Chlorine will gain one electron to form chloride. And they also will form the isoelectronic configuration, which is 1s2, 2s2, 2p6, 3s2, 3p6. So all these uh, three anion, they're having the same uh, electronic configuration. Now, let's get back to this uh, statement. The stable ion formed by Y has greater radius than the stable ion formed by X. Okay, let's say now the Y is a chlorine. The stable ion formed by the Y now is correct. And let's say the X is uh, phosphorus now. Okay, because it's on the uh, left hand side compared to the Y. And of course, it will produce a phosphide. So across a period, the proton number increases, attraction is stronger, and they're having the same electronic configuration, means the size of the chloride is actually smaller, stronger attraction. So means the X is not possible to be the phosphorus or sulfur okay, because the size of the phosphide or sulfide is much larger than the chloride so which is not fit this statement so we know that now the X is uh, from one of this sodium magnesium aluminum silicon So, and these elements, they will form the uh, ions with this configuration. So, this one is 1s2, 2s2, 2p6, only two electron shells, and this one is uh, much larger than this. So, we know that the numbers of electrons in the stable ion X, it must be 10. So means it's A or B. Elements with greater atomic radius. So it must be X. Because it's a uh, atomic radius. So across the period, the atomic radius decreases. So the X must have the greater atomic radius compared to Y. So answer is A. That's all. Thank you.